Howdy, and welcome back to Zeman Outdoors. Today, on Skillet Sundays, we're gonna be cooking up a perfect Super Bowl favorite since today is Super Bowl Sunday. And we're gonna do a meatloaf stuffed with pepperoni and mozzarella cheese. Again, this is a keto-friendly recipe. I figured this would be a good alternate for some pizza on Super Bowl Sunday. So for this recipe, you're gonna need about two to three pounds of meat. I have close to two and a half pounds of ground venison. You'll need some salt, you'll need garlic powder, onion powder, you'll need some minced onions, you'll need oregano, basil, and parsley. And then usually I'll use minced, dried minced garlic, but I only have regular minced garlic. You'll need two eggs, about five to six ounces of pepperoni. You'll need a 16 ounce block of mozzarella cheese and a 12 inch cast iron skillet. Before you get started, you wanna go ahead and preheat your oven to 350. You'll go ahead and add your two to three pounds of meat. I'm using ground venison here. You can use really any type of meat you want, turkey, beef, venison, elk, anything. You'll need two eggs, two teaspoons of dried basil, two teaspoons of parsley, two teaspoons of oregano, two teaspoons of salt, a tablespoon of garlic powder, a tablespoon of onion powder, a tablespoon of minced onions. And since I'm using fresh minced garlic, I'm not gonna put as much. Usually I do a full tablespoon and just do a little bit under a tablespoon. And then you can go ahead and mix that all up. Once you have it mixed up nicely, you'll take about a third of your mixture and you're gonna form it into about a 10 inch by seven inch or so base. Next, you'll take your pepperonis and you'll just layer some pepperonis here in the middle. Take your block of cheese. I went ahead and cut this in half. I didn't think I needed the whole 16 ounces. And then you will lay your pepperonis around your cheese now. And then throw some on the top. Now you take the rest of your meat and just start forming it around your pepperonis and cheese mixture. Then you'll take the rest of your pepperonis and you can kind of layer them on top a little bit. And now it's ready for the oven. You'll put this in the oven for about 40 to 50 minutes. Really, this is going to depend on how thick your meatloaf is, how much meat you used. There's a lot of variables here, so make sure you use a meat thermometer and pull it out when the meat thermometer reads 160. After about 50 minutes, you can pull out of the oven and serve. Thanks for joining me today on Super Bowl Sunday.